Okay. I'm so excited! Oh I'm excited my god. Are you excited? Turn down? Nope. Gotta, gotta, just, give me medium level excitement. That's medium excitement. Okay. Medium okay. excited. Okay. So, welcome to the Northern Nest Podcast. It's not an episode. What? 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 <laughs> Jocelyn had a half baked idea. Diana, being the kind, benevolent goddess that she is, uh, didn't tell me no. So here we are. <laughs> now I'm going to explain this now three-quarter baked idea. <laughs> we'll see how it does. <laughs> Better put it back in for another five minutes. <laughs> yeah. Did the fork come out clean? <laughs> <laughs> uh, with everybody having an exceptionally ill crappy year. We're, we're just, we're all having a bad year. And all of us taking to crafting because if we're honest, it is still cheaper than therapy, no matter how much yarn we buy. <laughs> Fair. And it feels like everybody and their dog running a knit along right now. Cat, bird, budgie, octopus, mythical sea creature. I don't know what you keep for pets. It's fine. <laughs> so instead of running another knit along, because holy Hannah, there's Christmas, there's knit along, there's test knitting, there's stuff coming out. Everyone wants to celebrate and be done with 2020. I was like, hey, let's do a finish-a-thon. And I said, sure. <laughs> <laughs> he said it with confidence. <laughs> so much confidence. No, I think I uh, I didn't look at Discord for a few hours, and then there was uh, Just a lot of discussion. Me. <laughs> and uh, I'm like, okay, well, I guess we're doing this now. <laughs> sure, sounds great. It was like all planned and like this cool. <laughs> so here's an idea. Austin's like, cool. Here's a really even better idea. I'm like, great. Dad is like, ah, I work for like what? <laughs> I go to work for three hours, you two. <laughs> Suddenly I'm doing a knit along. Okay, cool. And I mean, you don't have to do anything special for it. The rules are super basic and even for us, very wide open. And we don't really restrict much. <laughs> it's fair. We, we don't. As, as a general rule, we're pretty open. We're opening this one up to kids' knits. That's right. You heard me. Children's apparel will count. Toys will count. One skein wonders will count. Totally tubular hats will count. All sorts of things count. The only rules are is whether it was a, a whip from eight years ago that you picked up and did a row on. <laughs> or a whip you started yesterday. So long as it's a whip, you're good. As long as you get it done before the 31st of December, it counts because it's about finishing things. What we're going to do is because uh, if Diana and I are honest, neither one of us really use Ravel Free. Ravel Free? <laughs> nope. Ravelry. <laughs> it's late. It's late. We're having a day. <laughs> Jocelyn's been painting for three hours. Her brain is fried. <laughs> Uh, neither one of us used Ravelry before they had problems. We certainly don't really use it now outside of literally pattern search databasing. We're not going to host it there because we won't check. We know we won't check and we're no I mean, longer going to lie to you guys and pretend we're going to check. <laughs> we didn't check in the first place. Let's be honest. This is why we got a moderator. It's why we have a beloved Asa who we are incredibly grateful for because <laughs> she just fills in the holes where we're perhaps less than um excellent podcasters <laughs> oops so we are going to host it across uh two platforms and we're going to open up our emails for everybody uh, just in case you don't participate in any one of those so obviously if you watch us on youtube you're in. You count. Totally do it. Join us. Absolutely. If you listen to us, absolutely join us. Use it. We got a hashtag. I'm going to say the hashtag and then I'm going to spell the hashtag and then Diana's going to put it in the show notes for everybody, which means it'll be in the description box below. It'll be on the Northern Knits podcast webpage and we'll make sure it's on the first Instagram post. So that way it's everywhere. And so long as you've used the hashtag, I can find you. Correct. Very important will, to use the hashtag. Otherwise, we'll I, lose your post. We'll lose it, and I won't have meant to have lost it, but it will be gone nonetheless. Uh, and it's going to be, obviously, the hashtag symbol. Shocking. I know. I know. It's late. I had a panic attack this morning. 
<laughs> it's been a day. Uh, N or sorry, yeah, NKP Finishathon 2020. So N K P F I N I S H A T H O N 2020. So obviously, because it is a finish a thon, we had to have finish a thon. We decided to put the year in there just in case we decide to do this again next year. And NKP stands for the Northern Nets Podcast. So that is your hashtag. It is the universal hashtag to use so I can find you. Uh, I'm going to be watching on Instagram. I'm going to be watching on our Facebook group. That's right. We have one of those. And I actually check it. <laughs> shock of all shocks because i know not everybody uses instagram not everybody uses facebook and some people only use youtube guess what that's why we're going to have the emails open as well too so you can also email your entries to northern knits podcast at gmail.com thankfully diana already links that down below yes every week <laughs> every week so we're going to do it that way we're going to run uh little galleries so i know uh if any of you guys have watched dunder knits or um caroline of off the grid fiber arts she does this where uh when you send in pictures of your work she'll post them with your name and what piece that you're working on and you get a little video spot so we're going to do those as well to showcase off all all of everybody's that's not an english sentence Let's back that up and try that again. Show off everybody's finished works because finishing a project is a huge deal. It's a huge deal and in good years. <laughs> it's, it's a massive deal this year. <laughs> the squirrel quota is high for Jocelyn. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So we wanted to, to celebrate with you guys and celebrate that. You know, we're almost at the end of the year. Whatever next year brings, that's next year. We can worry about that the 1st of January. But until the 31st of December, I think, let's let's celebrate finishing those Christmas nets, finishing up our own personal nets, casting on and finishing off items. Should we be a super speedy knitter? I'm looking at some of you because I know you guys knit fast enough that I look slow. And I'm not sure I am, so... <laughs> And I just, I'm, I'll just be a glacier over here, just creeping across the landscape. And one day I will actually open up a betting pool and we'll start taking bets on what time I finish <laughs> Hey, it's perfectly conceivable you could finish those fingerless mittens. Yes. I won't stick you with the shawl collar because that's a lot of knitting. We'll see. I really want to be done that. Oh, it's important to be on brand. Absolutely. <laughs> with the information that you guys give us for the entries whether you do the entry as a post on the facebook group the entry on instagram or as an email entry please list the pattern that you've used <laughs> i won't necessarily always recognize a pattern from the photo that's some reasonable. i will some i won't and if you don't want us to use your name indicate that in whatever format you've chosen. Because if you use Instagram, I'll use your Instagram name. If you email us, I'll use your name. But if you email us and say, this is what I finished and I really love it, here's the pattern, but please don't use my name. It'll just be the picture of your finished object and the project name on the bottom. That is absolutely something we can do. You just, you have to remember to tell me because I'm not gonna know your preferences. I'm not, um, what's that fancy O word that means godlike? Oh, uh uh omnipotent thank you i can't ever get that out of my face uh nor am i psychic i just a regular old human uh <laughs> and i need to be told what is okay and what is not okay because i just won't know off the top of my head well you're not telepathic uh, no <laughs> strangely oh. enough i'm not oh goodness everything this starts rolling for the first of november so the very first whip you finish as of the first of november qualifies for entry why well, we don't have any plans to really do any prizing at this point just to just to do a celebration on completed objects for the end of the year if that changes at some point we'll let you guys know but as this was a half-baked idea that i spat out at diana when we finished recording the other day <sighs> mm-hmm it didn't go up in this week's podcast. And I went, oh boy, we should tell people. Mm -hmm. So here we are letting you know that uh, we're going to do a thing. And we hope that all of you guys can join us for your thing. And yes, how please often, join us for the thing. How often do we leave it open for kids' knits and toys? I want to see all the pretty finished objects. 
Oh, I'm hoping for Christmas ornaments. I won't lie. I want to knit vicariously. Oh, Christmas ornaments and little wee baby hats. God, I want the cute stuff, guys. Give me the cute stuff. Come on, the cute stuff. <laughs> My little human is 14, like less than a week. <laughs> She's not little. She's not She's little, not anymore. little anymore. She's a monster. She's a teenager. She's a oh, full sized human. That's still growing. That's terrifying. Oh my god, isn't it though? <laughs> All right. Well, we're gonna let you guys go. We look forward to seeing your entries and stuff. Come check us out. If you don't follow us in the Facebook group, if jump in and join. Like we I'm gonna say until we see you again, because I've had another half baked idea. I'm Jocelyn. <laughs> and I'm Diana. And technically we're a podcast. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't open with that, did we? Nope. <laughs> I sure didn't. We're a podcast full of half baked ideas. Oh, well, some days. <laughs> <laughs>